Hi, I'm Sam Burrows. I'm the Director of Engineering for Nostrum High Performance, and I'm here to talk today about the Subaru High Pressure Fuel Pump. Now, I know this is a product that we've been promising for quite some time, and we didn't quite expect the engineering behind it to be as time-consuming as it was. But, of course, as you know, it's here, it's real, it exists, so let's talk about what it is and what it does. Now, the Nostrum High Performance Fuel Pump looks extremely similar to the OEM Subaru fuel pump, which I'm holding in my right hand. In fact, besides the logo that you can see stamped on the back of the Nostrum pump and the spring retainer and cap, the pumps are identical. And this is, of course, by design, because we always strive to have direct drop-in replacement fuel systems. Now, it's very important to point out that this is a brand new fuel pump. Every single one of them is made from a fresh core they are all flow tested at different speeds at full pressure and when they arrive to you, you know that you're receiving a pump that works and has been validated. This is very different from the proposition of sending you a couple parts so that you can rebuild a used pump in your garage. Now of course we appreciate that there will always be some do-it-yourselfers and that's a way to get things done as well, but we just feel that a brand new low zero mileage pump is a better route for long-term longevity. Let's talk a little bit about how the pump works and what it can and can't do. In essence, a high pressure fuel pump consists of a piston that's driven by a three lobe of the camshaft. Every time the engine turns, the fuel drive lobe turns and the piston goes up and down. So when we say that the Nostrum high pressure fuel pump has 40% increase in capacity over the factory pump, what we mean is the surface area of this piston is 40% larger. So every time the piston goes up and down, you are getting 40% more fuel. But of course, the high pressure fuel pump is only one component in the total fuel system. It is fed from the fuel tank by the low pressure fuel pump. Some people forget to upgrade the low pressure fuel pump and then find that the high pressure fuel pump is not meeting the fuel demand. That is not because the high pressure fuel pump is not working. It is simply because a 320 liter per hour high pressure fuel pump needs at least 320 liters per hour coming from the low pressure pump in order to work. Typically for the work that we do at Nostrum, we like to use the Walbro 485. We've used other pumps as well, but it is important to note that the pump does require sufficient in-tank pump capacity. Now, why would you want to upgrade the high pressure fuel pump? Of course, to make more horsepower is the answer most people would think of, but it's not just about making more power, it's also about making power safely. And one of the best things that we have here in the United States is the ability to run our vehicles on E85. As you know, E85 being mostly ethanol has a very high uh, octane rating, and that means the engine is very unlikely to knock, so it's very easy to make power safely, even under very warm conditions. The problem is that with a factory fuel pump, you can't quite run E85 in your car. So a lot of people resort to E30 or E50 type blends. Now the issue with intermediate ethanol blends is that ethanol and gasoline have very different additive packages. So what I mean by that is the gasoline that you get from the gas station is not just a blend of petroleum distillates. There are also things like detergents and corrosion inhibitors, and these things are not always soluble in ethanol. So as you blend in between E85 and E0 or E10, some of the additives tend to come out of solution. And these are the slimy substances that you sometimes see in your fuel tank clogging up the inlet sock of the fuel pump. Those also like to clog up the high pressure fuel pump or the low pressure fuel pump or other things in the fuel system. So what we really want to do is we want to enable vehicles to run on full E85 without having to resort to blending and specialty mixtures of ethanol because that is at the end of the day more reliable. And with the high pressure fuel pump upgrade from Nostrum, you're able to do that all the way to about 600 wheel horsepower. We feel this is a great upgrade. Uh, we feel strongly enough about it that we have one in our own personal 2016 WRX, which is doing great. Uh, and we hope you like the product. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out and ask us about it.